Porsche or a Ferrari. I think I'm gonna go with a Ferrari. The next one is never play computer games again or never watch a video on a computer again. Um, I hardly ever watch videos on my computer anyway, but I did start getting into computer games a few months back. Um, so I'm gonna go and never watch a video on a computer again. Okay, this one's interesting. Um, have a 20 million YouTube subscribers or produce a blockbuster action movie. Well, that's self-explanatory. Even the app is telling you to subscribe, so have 20 million YouTube subscribers. Not be able to sit or not be able to stand. questions raise more questions like if I'm not able to stand what about walking will I be able to walk but not stand still it doesn't say stand still but at the same time if I'm not able to sit it means that I will probably pass out from exhaustion really quick whereas most people who work in an office job can sit for hours, but not many people can stand for hours. So I'm gonna go with not be able to stand. Get $100,000 now or get $1 million in five years. Well, if you can invest, if you know how to invest $100,000 now, then you can make a million or even more in five years. But I don't know how to invest it. And one million in five years is going to be a lot less than it is now. I mean, in value. So I'm gonna risk it and say get $100,000 now and I will attempt to invest it. Be invisible, be able to fly. I wish I could pick both. Um, fly. I think it would be fun to fly. It will be even better if I can fly and be invisible because nobody can, can see me. Um, I'm gonna go with be able to fly. Always speak all your thoughts out loud or never speak even in sign language. You know, recently my thoughts have been really philosophical and not about other people, so I think I can get away with always speak all my thoughts out loud right now. But I'm pretty sure I'm gonna hurt everyone, so I'm gonna en end up being alone. Um, never speak again, even in sign language. Now, see, they thought of this one. Because they thought, okay, someone's gonna say, I can do sign language. Um, I think I'm gonna go with always speak all my thoughts out loud. And see how fast I end up alone. Buy everyone here drinks. Be teased about being a cheap ass for the rest of the game. 
well, since I'm the only one here, I'm gonna go with PT's developing humor. <laughs> I'm joking. Um, it depends. Yeah, the thing is, when you, when you go out with people, drinks going rounds, so like, first is one friend's turn, then it's another friend's turn, so it doesn't make much sense. Usually I'm the one who starts saying I'm gonna buy everyone drinks and then once they're a little bit tipsy they start buying everyone else drinks So I'm gonna go with the first one Be a carrot, be a pickle I'm gonna be a carrot because I like orange Get 50 watches or get 50 suits because some of the watches I could get they will increase in value whereas suits have a certain wear and tear on them and also I don't really wear suits so 50 watches spend 5 years in prison but return to your old life never go to prison but move every year for the rest of your life does it mean move countries because that could be a great adventure but moving houses and staying in the same city it's gonna get tedious but also spending five years in prison it depends what kind of prison and the experiences you're gonna have and how tough it's gonna be I'm gonna take a hopeful guess and assume that I'm gonna be moving countries every year but for the rest of my life I'm pretty sure in a few years I'm gonna get tired of it I'm gonna go with how it feels right now so I'm gonna go with uh, move every year for the rest of my life be an 80s child star actor be a 60 one hit wonder 60s, not 60. Um, I think I'm gonna go with 80s. Never had to tie your shoes again. Never had to entangle headphone wires again. Well, um, right now, most, almost all headphones or Bluetooth except the ones I have on my microphone but they never get tangled because I only have them on my microphone um, so I'm gonna go with um, never have to tie shoes again never have as high, high salary in a job you hate never have a low salary in a job you love if you have a sa high salary in a job you hate it depends on how high it is then you can quit quicker and do something you love with your savings and then you might end up having a low salary at a job you love for example if you start a business but that's gonna be at first hopefully if you know the right people then you can increase over time um, so I'm gonna go with I have a high salary in a job you hate Believe in God, renounce God and have one billion dollars I'm not very religious So I'm gonna go with renounce God and have one billion Have a black wedding dress, have a red wedding dress I don't know who was showing me this. One of my friends um, was showing me black wedding dresses and they're actually quite beautiful. I haven't seen many red ones, but the black wedding dresses and black wedding themed 
use it as much but I use it more than Facebook for 
working as a professional travel traveler, you could also get some free hotel stays. So that one work ten hours a day, four days a week, or work eight hours a day, five days a week. Um, I would rather do the first one and have three days off instead of two. Only use a Mac, only use a Windows PC. I use both. I use Mac for personal stuff and Windows PC for work. prefer a Windows PC. I feel like I, I have more freedom when it comes to certain things. Work a minimum wage job for the rest of your life. Live in the wilderness for the rest of your life. I don't know how I can, sur can survive in the wilderness if I have accommodation. Do I have to live off the land? one. Unfortunately, it's gonna be a sad life, but I'm not sure how I'm gonna survive in the wilderness. Work at the FBI, work at the CIA. Um, I think it depends. If I work at the CIA, do, do I get access to all the Classified, all the not declassified, all the classified documents, because that would be interesting. The FBI. I think I'm gonna go with the CIA. Lose your preferred thumb. Lose the index and middle finger of your preferred hand. I think I can. If I can lose a thumb instead of two fingers, and it's the one I prefer, I could go with the left hand. Is it the preferred or dominant thumb? I don't know. I'm gonna go with the thumb. Have to learn how to walk again. Have to learn about every date in history and why they were important. Have to learn about every date in history. See how you die. See who you will marry. I already know this one, but see how I die. I think it's gonna traumatize me and it's gonna make me worried and anxious about it so I would rather stick with what I know work as a chocolate tester taster work as a mattress tester mattress tester because I don't really like chocolate have a blind date with a homeless person kiss a homeless person I'm not sure we were asked this before I think we were some of the questions are circling around but in case I haven't because I don't remember I think I would go with have a blind date with a homeless person because then we can have a good conversation whereas kiss someone random just for a second there is no point I don't like kissing people I don't know be as you are now have a 100 million dollars but have a 5% chance of instant death every day a 5% chance is um quite high I, I remember I was listening to the to this podcast about um, from Freakonomics and they were saying that um, because they're, I think most of them studied economics and they re 
research a lot of data they were saying that if we could only drive if the only thing we did was drive for our entire life and we didn't die from anything other than driving according to the data it would take us 250 years of unlimited driving day and night for us to get killed which is amazing but the 5% chance I don't know how high it is according to data so I'm gonna go with B as I am right now own a penthouse own a villa a villa Live in isolation, face your biggest fears once, once a month. I feel like I'm getting stronger recently with what I've been going through, so I'm gonna go with face my biggest fear once a month now. Change your religion, change your political party. Again, I'm not a very religious person and I'm not very fanatical about a certain political party if what if the representative of the political party I don't agree with then I'm gonna look somewhere else to vote So I'm gonna go with change my political party because even though I'm not religious, religion is like a certain certain beliefs you have. Even though you don't believe in someone, it's certain beliefs you have you wouldn't want to change because it's like a hierarchy of beliefs and values that you wouldn't want to change. But political party. Some politicians are not that are not to be taken seriously. So political party not wear shoes for the rest of your life, not to drive a car for the rest of your life. I'm gonna go with oh not wear shoes, it's gonna be painful. It's okay there we have public transport. I'm going to go with not drive a car, be smart and lucky, be dumb and really lucky. I told you these questions always circle around. So I'm going to go again with be dumb and really lucky. Always be late, always be on time but unprepared for most activities. I would rather be late. Always have fingernails five inches long. Oh, that's that's too much. Always have a snorkel on your face permanently. You know, I started not being able to have long fingernails. I just, I can't. I'm struggling. Even though I loved long nails, it's just right now I can't have them by the snorkel on my face permanently. I'd rather get used to five, five inches that's really long for fingernails. It's gonna be like claws. I can't have to go with the, with the snorkel. Only read romance novels on re only read textbooks again textbooks never have sex again never learn anything new never learn anything new always have mud on your shoes always have a pebble in your shoe that's gonna be pretty annoying 
always mean like if I take my shoe off and get rid of the of the pebble, does it appear instantly or in like an hour or is that a daily thing? I would rather go with the mud on my shoes. Control the emotions of those around you, control the weather. I think I'm gonna go with control the emotions of those around me just to keep them safe. I can make them happy when they're sad. Control your dreams. Watch them the next day. What do you mean watch them the next day come to life? What does that mean? I have no idea, but control my dreams. Sleep on the floor wearing PJs but have no pillow. Sleep on the floor entirely naked but have a pillow. Well, it depends because sometimes if it's marble floor, it's a little bit cold. I think I'm gonna go with uh, sleep on the floor wearing PJs but have no pillow. Never have to tie your shoes again and never have to untangle headphone wires again. Again, this question is easy repeated one. Have a Pepsi, have a Coke. Coke. Have a black wedding dress. The ones that are repeating, I'm just gonna click them. Use only Reddit for the rest of your life. Use only YouTube for the rest of your life. Use only YouTube. Buy everyone here drinks. Be teased. Again. Live without your phone. Live without your computer, iPod, and clean clothes. Well, I don't have an iPod. But I do need my computer to work. And pretty much everything on my phone can be done on a computer. And I do want clean clothes, so... Never be able to hear your favorite song again. Never be able to watch your favorite movie again. I don't really rewatch movies, but I do listen to my favorite songs on repeat, so never be able to watch my favorite movie. Get four hours of sleep per night, or get 15 hours of sleep per night. Get four hours of sleep. I'm quite used to it. Have a beer belly. Have three chins. Maybe have three chins. Have paparazzi follow you around. Reveal a different secret about yourself in a weekly newspaper column. Well, if I have paparazzi following me around, that would make me famous. But reveal a different secret about myself in a weekly. I'm gonna run out in a month because I don't have many secrets. So, I don't really know. Let's go with this one. Have a Lamborghini, have a personal driver, supercar. But it's nice to be chauffeured around. We said this before. Have a time machine that only goes back in time. Have a time machine that only goes forward in time. If I have a time machine that only goes back in time, I can go back in time and change so many things and the future. But going forward in time won't really change anything. And if I go forward in time, that means I won't be able to come back. And at the same time, I won't be able to come forward. But I can save more people going back in time that I know I can save going forward in time. 
like my hair, but I want to want them. I wouldn't want them covering my entire body and be completely bald. I don't know. who have hair covering their entire bodies, they do waxing, they do all sorts of things. So I'm gonna go with that one. Get completely drunk after a single unit of alcohol, never be able to get drunk, never be able to get drunk. Be able to fly at walking speed, be able to run at speed of cars. Well, if I'm able to run at the speed of cars, then it means I don't need a car. I won't pay for gas, and I will be able to go anywhere I want, so run at the speed of cars. Constantly have your hand down your trousers. <laughs> Swear in every sentence forever. The last one, and we're gonna do one more because I'm getting a little bit sleepy. Lose my sight or lose my hearing. I think I'm gonna go with lose my hearing because I do like painting a lot. So, okay. I think that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching and um, I'll see you in my next one. Sweet dreams.